What's up guys, Alex here. And today I wanna to do a video on the best chest exercise. Um, it's gonna be a short and sweet and simple video, but I think it's important nonetheless. Now, most people automatically assume that the best chest, chest exercise is gonna be the bench press because it's the most popular. It's the one that everybody cares about, right? Ooh, how much do you bench? That's all that matters in the lifting world <laughs> to some guys out there. And I don't even bench. I don't. I don't bench. And I think I have like pretty decent chest development. Um, but what I found to be an even better exercise for the chest is the incline chest press. So, I mean, you could argue it's pretty similar to the bench, but, and I use the barbell. So, um, you know, when you're at the gym, you'll have the flat bench, you'll have the incline, and you'll have the decline, right? And so for me, I find that when I get on the incline barbell chest press, right, the incline press, I feel the, the most amount of stretch in my chest, and I really do believe that feeling that stretch in the muscle is important to activate the muscle. Because feeling that stretch in the muscle in any exercise is important for mind-muscle connection. And that mind-muscle connection in and of itself does nothing. But what it allows you to do is utilize the muscle throughout the movement, which will lead to development of that muscle. So, if I'm benching and I don't feel it in my chest, God knows how I'm getting the weight up. It could be mostly triceps. It could be mostly biceps. It could be mostly shoulders. There's going to be some chest, sure. But, I mean, if I'm not really feeling it in the chest, I mean, how much do I really know that I'm working the chest out? But when I, you know, set myself up on the incline press, right, I, I use the full range of motion. I always use full range of motion. And I get to that bottom part of the movement, sorry. And I feel that stretch in my chest. That mind-muscle connection right there will allow me to utilize the chest muscle because I know that I'm working it. And I can focus more on using the chest to lift the weight up. Right, so I really feel the the stretch in my chest the most when I use when I do the incline chest press. I think it's way better than the bench. Plus, you get shoulder development, and who doesn't want bigger shoulders, right? You can't go wrong with shoulder development, <laughs> right? Why would you Why would you say no to shoulder development? It's better than the bench because you get chest and shoulders. Now, a bonus exercise here. Um, <clears throat> I really, really like machine flies. I love flies. I feel like machine flies really, really um, activate the chest muscle. I, can, I always finish my chest workouts out, out. <laughs> I always finish my chest workouts um, up with machine flies, right? And really it's a push workout because I do push pull legs, but, um, yeah, I always finish with flies. It's just the best finisher exercise. And I go heavy, you know, um, watch out for your shoulder joints because you can put a lot of stress on your stress on your shoulder joints when you're doing flies, especially heavy. But, you know, I go slow all the way back Oh, you know, feel, you know, stretch as back as, as far back as you can. And then slowly squeeze the weight together and then hold. And then all the way back and then squeeze the weight together, hold, right? And you can really feel it in your chest. So incline press and the machine fly are the two best chest exercises. So, 
thank you for watching. Um, just a short video. Goodbye. Subscribe. See you later. Talk to you soon.